Okay, it's movie time. I haven't done a little movie of uh, Shapeways models in a while. They're going to be kind of bright due to the sunlight, but I'd rather have them a little too bright than a little bit too dim. So this thing here is the, uh, I think it's called the Snow Tower by somebody else, actually, by some guy, Blue Shark 15 or whatever. And I just thought it was a cool model and actually came out pretty cool. came out pretty nice. It's just a nice spiral pattern. Uh, this is just a really simple model. It's a little uh, seaside bungalow by uh, Morgan, and uh, anyway, that came out nice too. It's just a cute little. It's just a cute little house. I wanted to have just a very simple model to show people that you know it didn't have to be super elaborate to uh, get a nice little model going. Um, so anyway, and that's like I don't know six fifty or something like that. Uh, this is a uh, I forget the official name. I think it's Crazy Cakes House. Uh, out on the ice, like, you know, it's, it's like the Winter Lodge or something like that. Um, it's kind of, I, I think it could have made it a little bit cheaper. It's kind of solid on the bottom, like, uh, you know, detail that you can't really see. But, um, you know, it's a pretty it's a pretty nice little model. I like the way the uh, snow came out on top of the trees. Here we have uh, Alexander Bowden's Creeper. you got to have a Creeper. Uh, I've resisted up to this point, but its charms, uh, you know, at $6.66. Um, I said, okay, sure, I gotta, I gotta go for that and get a little creeper that he made, or that I guess a friend of his made, and that we've turned into a little model. And uh, I finally got myself a nice Eiffel Tower. I um, tried an experiment with high res uh, textures to see if the texturing would come out a bit better, and uh, I don't know. <laughs> I mean, the textures are, you know, they are sort of what they are. Um, I think, it, I think using the super high res texture gave me. Uh, less chance of getting artifacts and so on, but I can't really tell any kind of difference as far as, uh, you know, whether it came out better or worse. Anyway, but I'm saving the best for last. This is, uh, this is Sterling Babcock's model called uh, Solomar, and it's, uh, or Solomars, I guess. Anyway, it's a, it's a very cool model. It has one of just about everything on it. It's got, uh, you know, all kinds of cool little details and so on. And uh, the best part is, is that he built it to uh, to take apart. So he built it in uh, layers, actually, and he sort of has these little um, fence posts. This is part of the fence post process or printing. You can now print little details like fence posts and uh, signs and stuff like that, and they'll actually come out with detail. Um, these are thickened so that they won't break off. And uh, even then, I think one sort of broke off in the corner, but that might have just been due to use. Um, because I've been showing this thing off. So anyway, this is the roof, obviously. Let's see, inside we have a bed and uh, some redstone, and you can see some of the cool details in there. Anyway, try not to shine it too much there. And there's the bottom. And next layer is where it starts to get really uh, pretty cool. There's all kinds of uh, another bed and uh, other little details in there you can see. And uh, you can see stills on the, uh, on the web page. And Anyway, that's the bottom, and it attaches nicely to this very bottom, which, again, lots of lots of cool details. Um, like, let's see, we have a, uh, well, like, for example, here is a dungeon. Whoops, that's my finger. Uh, right here is a dungeon, and this is sort of a nether area. It's got all this nether stone in it, sort of a sand kind of a place. Um, let's see, what else can I obviously point out? Lava, obviously. And... Uh, Anyway, just a bunch of a lot of a lot of pretty cool details there. Oh yeah, and there's a <laughs> hidden on the bottom are all the different kinds of cubes that are uh, wool, the different colored wool there, and uh, it also has a signed. Uh, you sort of have it has it embossed on the bottom with his name and so on. So anyway, that's about it. I just wanted to show off those cool models, and uh, anyway, there you go. <laughs> Bye now.